Buttermilk Ski Resort offers train for all skill levels and is rated one of the best places to learn how to ski or snowboard in North America. Buttermilk is 470 acres with many beginner and intermediate groomed trails, but there are still expert runs for those progressing their riding to the next level. Where the experts thrive are the terrain parks, which hosts the Winter X Games and the best riders each year. For those into ski touring or split boarding, there are three skin tracks up the mountain offering a fun way to practice and exercise in a low risk environment. Well, hi there. Jeff and Jennifer here with Snowboard Traveler. Welcome to Buttermilk, Aspen, Colorado. They have mostly green and blue runs here, but there is a section of black runs. This is where the X Games are held every year, but they have the extra small, small, and medium sized parks open for the general public, and those have been super fun. Aspen is in west central Colorado and at least a four hour drive from Denver in winter. It's worth taking the one hour connecting flight to the local airport, which is right near Buttermilk. All four Aspen Snowmass resorts are within 20 minutes. There is ample free parking at the base, a beginner lift, and the Summit Express Quad up the main section of the resort to Cliff House Bistro. West Buttermilk Quad services the west face of the resort and beginner terrain park. The third and newest lift is Tie Hack to the intermediate and advanced terrain with a small parking lot at the bottom. Each of the three areas has a designated uphill route. The base of Buttermilk has the Hideout Children's Center, the Bumps and Home Team Barbecue restaurants, and the Inn at Aspen next to convenient parking. Newbie riders have Panda Peak to learn how to get on and off a lift and navigate a gentle slope near the base. The resort is very beginner friendly and the lifties had a dance party going at the Summit Express lift, spreading all the good vibes. This lift services the middle of the mountain with long cruisers top to bottom. Advanced all mountain riders will likely visit the other three Aspen mountains. This helps keep the slopes relatively uncrowded and free of speedsters, allowing beginners and families to enjoy exploring comfortably. You can still find a fun challenge here, like the Aspen Glades off the sides of the main trails in good conditions. Several adventure zones exist along the way, such as Fort Frog, if the little ones get bored of riding. In addition to the jail, rope bridge, and slide, there's a candy shack. This is what happens when you go speeding through a slow zone. Along the cruiser runs in the middle of the resort are some small terrain park features like the mini half pipe and mini bore across bank turns. More advanced riders can enter the expert terrain park at the top of the lift. The terrain park has a wood section which leads into intermediate and advanced jumps and rails. Many features were under construction when we visited, so for those looking for a more extensive terrain park, try nearby Snowmass. Closer to the bottom of the mountain are the professional jumps built for Witcher X Games in late January. There's more beginner and intermediate terrain with easy cruising on the west side of the resort. Also here are kids' adventure zones in the trees that are fun for all ages. West Buttermilk Express services this area, and there is a mid-mountain access point in case you don't want to ride all the way down to the bottom. At the top, you will find the beginner terrain park. There are several easy rails along with rollers and small jumps, perfect for those new to freestyle. Last but not least is a tie hack express lift and the more advanced yet still approachable part of the mountain. Keep in mind the runs are all relative to others on the resort. Although these are marked black diamonds, they would be more of a blue-black rating on one of the other Aspen resorts. High-functioning beginners ready to test the edge of the comfort zone can progress here. The Cliff House restaurant sits at the summit with spectacular views up the valley. The Cliff House is a perfect place to grab Mongolian barbecue lunch and enjoy the view. On Friday mornings, the restaurant serves breakfast and during full moons, dinners. But the only way to get there at that time is by skinning or snowshoeing uphill. Skinning or uphilling involves attaching skins to the bottom of your skis which help grip the snow so you can climb the mountain with no lift required. We used our split boards, which are snowboards designed to separate into two skis. The climb up tie hack includes 1,700 feet of elevation gain ending just above 9,700 feet. It is a fun way to get some exercise with friends, test out your split boarding gear, and end it with breakfast at the Cliff House. Well, thanks for riding with us at Buttermilk Mountain in Aspen, Colorado. We're Jeff and Jennifer with Snowboard Traveler, and we'll see you at the next mountain.